But is that right? Police are looking into whether a teenage boy sexually assaulted another student inside the school. The boy was arrested, but some students think he's innocent and wore T-shirts today to support him. Nick Montez talked to students this morning. I spoke to several students here at Whitefish Bay who are very surprised to hear that a sexual assault could have happened inside their school. But what they find most shocking is support for the accused. This photo posted on Twitter shows a homemade T-shirt supporting a 15-year-old boy accused of sexually assaulting a girl at Whitefish Bay High School. We are not naming him because he is a minor. Some students wore the T-shirt to class. Others had it in their hands when they arrived to school. I was wondering if I could talk to you just about why you're wearing it. And oh, no. Why not? Why can't you tell us? The alleged sexual assault happened last week in a stairwell inside the school. The 16-year-old girl also attends the school. She claims he forced her to have oral sex, but after being arrested, he told police she initiated the act. His supporters online continue to stand by him and that he did nothing wrong. Do you um, think it's right for students to support him? Well, they're their friends and teach their own. Ava Gonzalez says at least one of her classmates posted their support on Facebook. She says it's disgusting. I want to say no, no, no. He deserves what he got if he actually did this. We tried to find out if the students who wore the t-shirts were forced to change or go home, but we were told the superintendent wasn't available to talk to us. Hopefully we'll get more information as a school. Now that 15 year old boy has not been charged. Investigators are still reviewing the case in Whitefish Bay. Nick Montez today's TMJ4. Nick, thank you. And this is not the first time the boy has been in trouble. He told police that a girl accused him of pulling his pants down in class two months ago.